Hi guys, it's Yusuf from the Tech Geeks here, and Harrison is actually in the same room. But today we are going to be doing a comparison on two different VR headsets, which is virtual reality headsets. Um, first one we have here is the Visor. As you can see, there Harrison is showing off the box. Nice packaging, nice box. This is we actually got this from London when you you saw you probably saw the vlog. So yeah, I'm just gonna open this up. I have one myself. This is personal. This is Harrison's because I'm at his house. Um. So yeah, here's the Visa headset. It's a really nice. Um, uh, like I like the black. It's the only color it has, but still nice. So there's a slot for your phone, and it looks pretty small, but it does actually fit Harrison's phone, iPhone 6 Plus. So it's nice and comfortable. Uh, it's quite like it's it's a bit comfortable. Uh, you can obviously change the adjust the whatever the straps there and with on you look like a bit of an idiot but you do with any vr headset really and you can play a game it's really it's really good and nice quite light uh plus uh, the plastic's all right i guess i would have liked a bit of stronger material but what can you do um yeah, so, so so this makes your head really comfortable. I don't know. Uh, in the box, it did come with some packaging, but Harrison lost a bit of the stuff in London. It comes with a cloth. To really good. The lens. Yep, to clean the lens. Yep. Just do that now and there, and it's all nice and clean. And yeah, that's the that is the Visor virtual reality headset. Okay, now it's Harrison's turn. Hi guys, what's up? It's Harrison. Um, hope you like the Visa headset there, but this time we have a different one. So this one is an um, Richard R I R I Tech Ritech um, mobile mobile VR headset. I prefer this one to be honest because uh, it's a lot more comfy on the head when you were using it for a long period of times. You can play games, um, watch movies. All that good stuff so i have opened this and i've just put everything back into the box as you can see on the side just there watch 3d movies play vr games 360 videos all right so let's get into the box so nice sturdy box i bought this off amazon the link will be in the description i don't have the link for the visa but i try and find yeah, one yeah we picked that up in london so we'll tr maybe we get it try and find one on amazon if i do i'll be under there but if it's not Sorry about that, but I do definitely have the link for this one. So, in the box, we're greeted with the user manual. Just tells you the product description, uh, all that good stuff. Don't need it. Then we have the headset itself. In the box, we just have two extra foam pieces to adjust around your nose, which you don't really need because the headset is really comfy itself. I'll probably use these on the uh, Visa. Well, I don't know how to say it. Visual. Visual headset because this one's really comfy but the other one is not the best but yes okay anyway cut long story short inside the box just the headset itself it, it, it's got a much more modern look when I put it on so how does it feel it feels really like this one here it pushes it I take it out we'll do a comparison yeah the foam right foam on this one looks a lot more soft and all like squishy but there's not much protection around the nose like because the nose piece oops the nose piece is really close into your nose so you can when um my nose is quite big so when it's on your nose well my nose pushes against the top of it as you can see here i had to put like a foam padding there because it does get quite um this kind of like i suppose it's, it's, yeah it is really uncomfortable but this one there's like a lot more room around the nose the padding is just nicer even though there's not as much of it so much nicer especially this headpiece here it really puts like comfort on comfort onto your head but it's just a lot nicer um i'll go around the product on the side we have um an area so you can put your headphones all your put um, room for your ports both sides that is on the um inside the headset this one is like a suction cup a really strong one and the other one is just like 
It's very hard to get in, like, stretchy thing. Not stretchy it thing. is. Like, it, it breaks it, it, it just scratch your phone a little yeah. bit as well. So, that is that one. But this one is a really nice one because it just, it sticks really well. Um, it's easy to get off. But it's strong. Um, inside the headset here, you can just see the, uh, the two lenses. This is where your phone will go. So, your phone will go here. This closes like that. And the other end where your eyes go is just the lenses with that, like like that. Sorry. What's the quality of the plastic? The plastic on this one, I think it's a lot stronger than this one. Like, I know this is a bit weird, but this one sounds stronger, but trust me, it isn't. But like, this one's a lot heavier, which I think is good. Yeah. But when it's on your head, you can't feel that because of this much better strap, like here. It's like really, um, it's, it's kind of filled like filled with air. This one's just a bit of like leather. Mm. Anyway, let's uh, on the top we have two adjustment like things. So when your phone's inside, just adjust the size of your phone like screen. The button along the bottom. Um, Google Cardboards have a um, like Google's version of this. It's like a piece of it's a cardboard version, and there's like a magnetic switch on the side so you control some of the games. This one has it here. So when I push this, it's like pushing a stylus against a screen so most apps uh, support like need this like with this one it doesn't so you have to take the headphone out of the headset and put it on that's just the thing yeah. to put my headphone in so um we'll see you in a minute where we have have our thoughts together hello hello um so now we're just going to do a comparison of which one we think's the best so we're going to start with you Seth um i i put both on my head and i think personally for experience the i don't know they're both the same for experience all you is it depends on the game really uh this is lighter if you just want to walk around with it the, but the black one because it's better quality material it's going to be heavier obviously um for the padding, for how soft it is, I'm going to have to go with the white one, seeing as it's really nice and, and soft, just easy, it's just easy to put your head on without hurting, okay, and then, and then last, just, yeah, I think that's it, that's all you really need to do, uh, they both, they both work fine with uh, most phones, I've never seen, I haven't seen the phone yet that doesn't work with them, except for a, a brick, but okay, not a brick, <laughs> <laughs> um, but, yeah Harrison your turn oh yeah I'll give my I'll get out of 10 this gets a 7 out of 10 for me and the white one gets an 8 out of 10 so for me the white one wins right so for me I I, I agree with you Seth the white one is a lot more comfy to wear they both do the same sort of um thing but like the white they do all it is is the app so you download an app off the app store google play you put your phone in and that's like just the lenses that do all the work but then it's like I prefer white, which doesn't really make a difference. But white, the quality of this product, everything just feels so much more stronger. Even though this one was more expensive, this one was like twenty five pounds, and this one I think it was like nineteen ninety nine off Amazon. We got sent these um, for a review, but that's nothing to do with this video. Yeah, so uh, with this one, yeah, I give this one a nine out of ten, and I give this one the black one. A six out of ten only purely because of the comfort of this one and the uh, the looks of this one this one everything is just feels much better and yeah so as we said earlier the links will be in the description for tr we'll try both of them i don't know if i can find this one on amazon because um because we didn't get it off amazon we got it from london but i bought i got this one off amazon so if i can find it um i'll put the links in the description and i hope you enjoyed today's video you have anything to say no, I just hope you enjoyed the London vlog. We put quite a lot of work in that. Um, except for the outro, which unfortunately the music blocked over. And oh, yeah. we and we actually did try to take it out, but it um but something went wrong. They said if we had to take it out, it might have deleted the video or something. It's somehow so Sorry that the music was quite overpowering in the outro of the yeah, last time's vlog. But this is just more of an unboxing and review. So yeah, we I hope I hope you liked the video. Um, and tell your friends about the tech geeks, and just subscribe and like, and stay tuned for our next video. See Bye. you later. Bye. Bye.